Lizzie Holliday, also known as Lizzie McCallie, was an infamous serial killer from the late 80s. Born in Ireland in the 80s, 59, Holliday immigrated to the United States as a young woman and eventually settled in upstate New York. It was there that she would go on to commit a string of brutal murders that would earn her a place in history as one of America's most notorious female killers. Holliday's first known victim was her first husband, Charles Hopkins, whom she reportedly poisoned with arsenic in 8087. She would go on to marry and kill two more husbands as well as a number of other people, including her stepchildren and a neighbor who had witnessed one of her murders. She was also suspected of killing her own child, though this was never proven. Holliday was known for her erratic behavior and a violent outburst. She was often seen wandering the streets of her own town in a state of agitation and was known to lash out at those around her. Despite this, it wasn't until the murder of her third husband that she was finally caught and arrested. At her trial, Holiday initially pleaded insanity, claiming that she was being terminated by demons and that she couldn't control her actions. However, she later changed her plea to guilty and was sentenced to death by hanging. She was executed on November 20, 1894, in what could become one of the most heavily attended execution in New York State history. In the years since Holiday's execution, her story has become the stuff of a legend, with many rumors and legends swirling around her life and crimes. Some have claimed that she was a victim of circumstance, driven to kill by abuse and poverty. Others have suggested that she was a cold-blooded killer who enjoyed the thrill of taking lives. Whatever the truth may be, there is no denying the lasting impact that Lizzie Holiday has had on the world of true crime and the popular imagination.